Hi guys, welcome to this tutorial. If you are new here, my name is Leah and today I'm going to be teaching you guys Halazia by 80s. So I'm going to be giving this dance a difficulty score of 8 out of 10. So we're going to be doing a high intermediate dance. So what we're going to be doing today is an explanation tutorial of the pre-chorus starting from your sang's verse, then chorus and post-chorus. If you would like to practice with the music, then I will have my slow music tutorial linked in the top right hand corner in the card. If you would like to practice with a video where the explanation and the music is in one tutorial video for you, that is over on my Patreon page as usual. Huge thank you to the many people who have joined me on Patreon for the new year. Thank you guys so much for your support over on that platform. So we're going to get started. Remember if I'm speaking too fast or too slow for you at any point in this tutorial, feel free to change the speed of the video in the YouTube settings. Okay guys, this is lesson one and this is the pre-chorus. So we're gonna start when um, your song starts to sing. Now technically he's on the floor, but we're gonna start by standing up just to make it easier. And we're gonna face the right side just like he would be on the floor. We're gonna start by holding here for one. On two, we're gonna step forward with our right leg, get our right hand. We're going to bend our knees and swoop this hand from the right side of your face over. You just simply bend your knees and come over like this. Okay, so we're going to start again from the beginning. The counts will go one, two, three, four, all the way to the count of four. Next, we're going to go five, six. From here, we're going to swoop this right hand around. We're gonna step left, right to face the right side. Now you're gonna step your left foot on the floor, bending in your left knee. You're gonna get this gesture here with your left hand. You're going to pulse it off your mouth and away from you like this, okay? With your head kind of tucked in. So from the very beginning with the counts, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? So slightly leaning back, bending in your left knee, seven, eight off your mouth like this. So let's recap those first eight counts all the way from the beginning before we continue. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so from here, I'm going to demonstrate the next few counts. From here, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so what we're going to be doing from this position, you're going to put all your weight on your right knee, so your right knee should be poking forward. Right knee, slide up, then we're gonna do the left side. Left knee, slide up, right knee, slide up, left knee, slide up, okay? So make sure you just bend down, slide up, bend down, slide up like that, that kind of motion. From here, what we're going to be doing first with our hands, on our right knee, we're gonna get both our fists, push them behind our head and back. So, one, two. Now on the other side, we're gonna go three, Four, get your fists and put them in a diagonal gesture like this. Again, from this move. One, two, three, four. Next on the right knee again, five, six. Fists go strong down like this on your right knee. So again, from this part, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now the next time we go on the left knee, we're gonna go seven, eight. So as you go down on your left knee, you're gonna shake your shoulders like this. So start with whichever shoulder feels comfortable to you. It doesn't matter if you start shaking on your left or your right. So one more time from here, this will go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so let's go all the way from the beginning and add that all together with the counts before we continue. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now from finishing here while shaking your shoulders, we're going to go the next few moves. We'll go one, two, three, four. From here. You're gonna jump and put all the weight on your left leg. Left fist is going to extend. Right fist is going to swing two times. When we step down, you're on your left knee. You're gonna swing your right fist with your right foot. Step back down, 
swing again. So again, from here, this will go one, two, three, four. Okay, after four, we're going to go five, six. From here, your right leg should be off the floor. You're gonna slide on your right foot over to this side. Put your left hand open to your shoulder. Right fist is gonna swoop around like this. So again, from the end of here, when we shake our shoulders, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six. Now on seven, eight, we're gonna go seven, eight. From this position here, where we slide on seven, eight, I'm gonna get your hand, go in, in with your fingers like this, forward, forward on your right hand. As we do that, we're gonna jump with our right leg forward, left leg forward. Boom, boom, okay? Again, from here, the end of here, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that there is the first half. Let's go from the beginning and recap that now with the counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now from here, we're gonna be doing the second half of this lesson, part two. So what we're gonna do from here is go one, two. From the end of this move, we're gonna step forward with our, on our right toe, pointing forward our right knee. Left hand fingers open, are gonna go out and back. So from here, this is gonna go one, two. Now we're going to go three, four. We're gonna step forward with our left toe now, knee pointing forward. From here, this hand is going to go down. Right hand's gonna grab onto your elbow joint here and up, okay? Boom, boom. So from the second part, this will go one, two, three, four. Now on five, six, we're gonna go up on our left leg, put our hands in fists on either side of our body, five, six. So from here, go up on your left leg, you're gonna circle your chest around from right to left like this, go up on your left leg and raise your right. Try and point your knees out as much as you can without losing your balance. From the second part again, second half, this goes one, two, three, four, five, six. Now on seven, eight, we're gonna go seven, eight. From doing this move here, we're going to put our right foot down, separate our hands so they open out our knees, look down. Seven, eight, come up and put both your fists parallel to each other like this. So just before we continue, let's go from the second half after here and we do this move. Let's do that with the counts before we continue. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now from here, we're going to build up to the chorus. So what we're going to do is we're gonna walk up into our place like this on the spot. What we're gonna be doing is putting our hands up, touching together to the top. As they come down, you're gonna grab your hands together like this. From this position, this goes one, two, three, four in your place, then we're going to go five, six, seven. From here, you're gonna separate your hands and twinkle your fingers out on either side of your head. Now, as you do this move here, you're gonna kind of like, like blow, kind of like you're blowing smoke forward like this. Okay, that's the facial expression they're all doing when they do this move here. From here, after going seven, eight, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. On eight, you're gonna put your right hand to the top, left hand to the bottom like this. I am specifically following San in the middle. I'm gonna show you a picture of all their hands at this point. Some of them have this top right hand in a fist. So because I'm specifically following San, I'm gonna have both my hands open like this. From here, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So that is the first lesson pre-chorus done. What we're gonna do is go from the second half again after this move and we do it here like that. Then we're gonna go all the way from the beginning, the beginning of your science part where he goes like this 
da, 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 like that. Okay, so let's do that all now with the counts. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 All right, guys, this is lesson two, and this is the chorus. So we're following Sun in the middle right now. So this is what the next move is going to be. You're going to go one, two, three, four. Okay, so hands are open and you're looking to the front. What you're gonna do with your fists is you're gonna close them like this into fists and separate them apart. As we do that, we're going to look to the left side. So one, two, then we're going to go look to the front, three, four. So we're going to expand, expand these hands. Boom, boom. So you're gonna burst them forward. Again, one, two, three, four. On the final four, you want to slightly slide your right foot back and lean forward on your left knee. Okay, because we're going to go three, four, like that. From the beginning, we're going to go one, two, three, four. Slightly slide back. Now we're going to go five, six. Now the reason why you need to slide that right foot back is so you can lean forward on your left foot. You're going to put your hands in fist and you're going to bounce two times. One more time from the beginning. From here, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, slide back and bounce, bounce, five, six. Next demonstration, this is going to go seven and eight and. Okay, this move is really fast when you do it full speed. So this is after the bounce, five, six. You're going to step up with your right foot for this next move. We're going to go seven and you're going to get your hands up and close like a crocodile snap like this seven and then on eight and we're going to go eight expand your left hand to the left side right hand to your shoulder expand on your right knee eight and on and you're going to close this these hands together bending in your right knee from the bounce bounce five six this will go slowly seven and eight and okay so just before we continue let's do those first eight counts together from the beginning one two three four five six seven and eight and okay now from this bit what we're going to do is slap our hands down like this you're going to put your Right hand flat out to the bottom right, two fingers on your left hand to your wrist. So on one, we're going to go one, two. From here, go into this position as I mentioned, put it down to the bottom right, bending your knees. We're going to slide this all the way up our shoulder as we bend over to the left side. From this crocodile snap move here, that is after here, this is going to go seven and eight and one, two, then we're going to go three, four. We're going to pulse, pulse this right shoulder forward two times. Three, four. Then on five, we're going to, as we pulse off, we're going to slide this, these two fingers back down to the bottom right. Again, after seven and eight, and this will go one, two, three, four. Go back down five, all the way back down, five, 
Now, just before we continue from there, we're going to go all the way from the beginning, from here, so you guys know how to add all those parts together. Again, feel free to slow it down even further if you need to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And one, two, three, four, five. So we've just finished here on five. Next, we're going to go demonstration. This will go six, seven, eight. Okay, we're gonna put your hands in an X like this. We're gonna go up on your left. Six, seven, down on your right. Eight, jump in the middle. So your X shape is literally just following. Six, seven, eight. If you wanna do Yuno's version, he goes six with his left wrist facing out. Six, seven, he switches his wrist. Seven, eight. Okay, so I just thought I would add that small detail there in case you're interested. Some of the members actually do this twisting wrist thing, okay? So we'll go after this crocodile snap here from this move. This will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that is the first half of the chorus. Let's go all the way from the beginning and recap with the counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we finished with an X in the middle. I'm gonna demonstrate the next few moves. This will go one, two, three, four. Okay, so from this X, what you're gonna do is put your left hand facing out. Your right hand is gonna be in this gesture here, so two fingers and a thumb. You're gonna bring this up above your head, to the middle of your chest, to the left, to the right. So with counts, one, two, three, four. As we do that, we're gonna step out with our right foot, and what you're gonna do is step on your toe several times. One, two, three, four. So you're gonna have your right knee slightly bending inwards. If it's more comfortable for you, you can have your right knee pointing a little bit more outwards if it's more comfortable. So we've just finished here. Let's add that all together slowly. This will go one, two, three, four. So you step, step, step every time you do that. One more time. One, two, three, four. Now we're gonna keep stepping two more times. We're gonna go five, six. So step two more times with your foot. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have our hands open like this. We're gonna get our right hand hover in front of our left and pull our fists together like this. Kind of like you're pulling a bow and arrow like that. So this is gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. Make sure to look to the left when you do that. Five, six. Next, we're going to go seven, eight, and. So just from here, you're gonna be stepping right, left, right, left, and your hands from here, you're gonna circle first with your right hand up all the way around like this, and you wanna finish with your left hand here. So just before we continue, let's recap from the second part. So the second half from this move here with the counts. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and. Okay, now after eight, we're going to go one, two. From here, so your left hand should be at the top and your right hand should be at the bottom. Put your left hand behind your head and your right hand to your chest slash stomach, so kind of in the middle. As we do that, we're going to lift our right knee up and kind of tuck ourselves inwards. Okay, so seven, eight, and this will go one, two, you just hold here for two counts, one, two, now on three, four, we're gonna go three, four. From here, put your right foot down. As you put it down, you're gonna use this to push yourself up, join your fingers together at the top, over your head, lean forward on your left knee, and put your hands, which should be, your fingers should be interlocked, diagonally like this. After this move, seven, eight, this will go one, 
two, three, four. Now we're going to go five, six. You close this together, bring your elbows together. Five, six, seven, eight. On seven, eight, simply step backwards into your place. Okay? So again, from the end of here, this will go seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, so that is the end of the chorus there. Let's go from the second part now. So from the end of the X here, and we do this move like that. Let's go from there. And then we're gonna go all the way from the beginning of the chorus from this move here. So let's do all of that now with the counts. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay guys, this is lesson three, final lesson, and this is the post-chorus. Um, this is quite a tiring part. There's lots of like hard movements, powerful movements that you have to do. I'm gonna show you the demonstration of the first few moves. This is going to go one, two, three, four. Okay, let's just start with that first. So we've just slided back into our place. Step up with your left leg. We're gonna get our fists and bring our elbows in like this. So that's on one. One, on two, step with your right foot, two. So you wanna get these fists and bring them inwards. Okay, so again, one, two. Now on three, we're gonna jump onto our left leg. Three, lift your right like this. So you're gonna get your left hand and grab onto your right fist to the top. Three, four, on four, come down with your fist like that and step with your right foot that was in the air, forward. So again, from the beginning, from here. One, two, three, four. Now on five, six, we're gonna go five, six. From here, your right leg was forward. Next, we're gonna jump with our left leg forward. And as we do that, we're going to touch off our shoulders, left hand, right hand, touch off like this. So right hand's going to the top and left hand is going horizontally out like this. And you're gonna kind of look up, expand your chest as you do that. So from here on four, this will go five, six. Just before we continue, let's go from the beginning, from here, and recap with the counts. One, two, three, four, five, six. On seven, eight, we're going to go seven, eight. Okay, from here, your left leg is in front and your right leg is behind. Put your left hand to your side and your right hand to your shoulder like this. And as we do that, as we touch, we're gonna to tap off our right foot, tap. Now, as you tap, you're gonna do a jump. And as you jump and separate your legs, you're gonna also separate your hands like that, out to the right side. From here on five, six. Five, six, seven, tap, eight. Now, obviously, because I'm doing it in slow motion, I can't jump to match the beat but in a bit of a faster speed, it will look like this. Five, six, seven, eight. Just before we continue, let's recap those first eight counts all the way from the beginning. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight. Now these next four counts will go. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's just do those first. We have just finished here with our hands expanded open on eight. On one, two, step on your left leg, pointing at your left knee. Clap these hands off each other like this. Now as they clap off, you're going to curl your fingers into fists. So from the end of here, one, two. Now on three, four, we're going to go three. Step on your right leg and bring your fist parallel to each other over to the right side. So again, from there, one, two, three, four. You're gonna jump on your left leg, four over to the left side, bring your fist up above your head and raise your right foot. So again, one, two, three, four. Okay, just before we continue, we wanna keep adding these together so you know how to connect the moves. Let's go from the beginning, add that together and recap with the counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, Okay, so we've nearly finished this first half. This first half has a lot of moves. So we've just finished on four. Now we're going to go five, six, seven, eight. From here, what you're gonna do is throw your hands down, these fists, kick your right leg forward, kick and step. You're gonna step open, and as you do that, these hands that were up here, they're gonna come down and open out. Okay, so they're coming down, and they're gonna open out like this with your left hand to the bottom, right fist up. From this move here, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now we're going to go seven, eight. Right fist is going to hit, hit inwards like this. Seven, eight. Again, from this move here, one, two, three, four, five, six, jump open, seven, eight. Okay, so that is the first half. So many moves in the first half, so remember to take it slowly. Let's go from the beginning. So from here, dun, dun, dun. Let's go from there, and then we'll continue to the second half, which has a lot less moves than the first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. Next, we're going to go one and two. So from here, jump like this. You're gonna have a slight tilt to the left feet together. Left hand to the, fingers open to the side of your head. Right fist facing up. One, then on and two, we're gonna go and two. We're gonna twist it like that, kind of like you're turning a key that way. So you're gonna twist outward. Now, as we twist, we're going to lift our heels up and back in. So your feet, you're gonna twist your heels slightly up and back in. Twist up and back in, okay? So from here, seven, eight, this will go one and two. Then on three, four, three, four, five. What you're gonna do from here, Pull this away from your face, so your head's gonna to go to the right side, and this left hand is gonna curl from pinky to thumb. Do this while you keep your fist in the air. So from here, seven, eight, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, and on seven, eight, we're gonna go seven, eight. From here, six on seven, eight, step with your left, cross your right hand over, on your chest, seven, eight, step with your right, bend down forward, leaning forward, and cross the other arm over. So again, from here, let's go from the second half. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now the next part, we're going to go one, two, three, four. So from crossing our arms like this, we're gonna jump with our right foot in the front, have your hands like this. So your left hand's open, right hand's open. From picky to thumb, you're gonna curl your hand into a fist, slide this right hand up. From the end of here on six, this will go seven, eight. Now the new move, 
one, two, on one, two, you're looking down, one, two, as it slides up, three, four. Now your hand should be fully in a fist, you want to look up on three, four. Okay, so just before we continue, let's go from the second half again, from the end of here. When we do this move, let's do that with the count, and then we'll finish this lesson. Eight. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Now, technically, um, the next part that I'm going to do is um, Wu Young on the floor. He's on the floor, but we're standing up. I'm just going to follow his hand movements. What we're going to do is we're going to circle our hands on five, six from here. You're going to got your wrist, circle your hands and grab. Okay, so your right would be in the front like that. This will go five, six on seven, eight, seven, eight. Twinkle your fingers out like before. So that's what he does on the floor, but we're standing up. If you want to make it a little bit different, instead of staying in your place, you can swoop that right leg behind and twinkle your fingers out just to make it look a little bit more dynamic, I guess, than just staying in your place. So from here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and that is the end of this lesson. So what we're gonna do is go from the second part one more time after boom, boom, you're gonna come up, turn the key, done like that. Then what we're gonna do after that is go all the way from the beginning of this lesson from here. Da, da, da. Okay, we're gonna do all of that now with the counts. Eight, one and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. One, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to cool down and stretch after you dance. It's so important. I'm super sore after learning this dance this week. I have a full cool down stretching routine that you guys can do with me. I will link that in the top right hand corner of the screen. If you would like to learn a dance of similar difficulty level to this one, I will leave my high intermediate level playlist in the top right hand corner as well. Once again, thank you for watching this tutorial and I will see you guys in my next video.